Okay, this one should be a quick one. This is the a Nevada bill that will allow tech companies to create governments. Um, basically, what I've seen so far is in Nevada, this uh, the governor of Nevada, who is Steve Salak, Salak, Sol, Sis Solak, <laughs> basically announced a plan to have autonomous zones um, for companies and specifically tech firms to jump stop jump start the local nevada economy um essentially these zones would permit the companies to operate autonomously of their local government um they essentially would have the same power as the county that they were in or they are housed in the zones would permit the companies with large areas of land to form governments carrying the same authority as counties, including the ability to impose taxes, foreign school districts and courts and provide government services. So essentially the corporation or corporations would be able to control everything within that area and they would have the same power as a state county. Um, <laughs> so, I mean, this is hilarious to me in terms of all I'm seeing recently is that more and more, especially with like the Democrats, they are just proposing policies, handshaking, doing whatever they can to improve the lives of companies, giving the, these companies more autonomy to do whatever they particularly want to do. I mean, you got they're talking about they, they would for, they would essentially operate as the local government for this area. They can impose taxes, create courts, school districts like they this is getting to. I mean, we, we've seen it. this is getting to some weird like combination of fascism socialism it's it's like this weird combination being led by mainly the democratic party and it's some scary shit man <laughs> to think that it will be the leftist that will bring about the corporate takeover and the oligarchy that that's that's the crazy thing to me um basically to continue the uh, county, um, the county governor, the governor, the state governor basically said that this would be um, a different way to attract new new businesses and new companies versus the old way of using um, tax cuts, um, tax exemptions and um, public funding to try to pull and garner um, investment by these companies into these other states, obviously to get taxes and things like that and revenue. Um, they limited it to hold on because it says it right here. Uh, specific business areas, including blockchain technology, autonomous technology, the Internet of Things, robotics, artificial intelligence, wireless technologies, biometrics and renewable resource technology. So you would have to be a company working within these fields. Um, it's it, it <laughs> there. And then they talk about like, there's already companies that have bought up some areas and things like that. And, and I mean, I see it, it's cool. I'm not going to lie. This as a tech person, this is cool, but it's this weird dystopian shit that I like, I, I can't get, I can't get behind like it's it's too <laughs> it's too Blade Runner esque. It, it, that's that's the problem. It's too Blade Runner X. It's too Cyberpunk X esque. You know it's 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 weird, man. <laughs> it's weird. All right. So um, again, this is just a bill that's proposed. It hasn't gone through state legislator yet, so I don't know exactly how that's gonna work or what's gonna go on there so we'll see we'll see how it goes and um yeah <laughs> but anyway again this has been dj from the culture war thank you guys for showing thank you guys for watching like comment and subscribe and i'm out peace <laughs>